Uh, they just pulled away from us. You guys were used to playing without Kevin for much of the season, but having him back and then finding out late he couldn't play, does that kind of disrupt the rhythm a little bit? Not at all. Uh, I kind of just had to figure it out, to be honest with you. Um, they played two bigs. They made an adjustment in the second half. That's what got them off to the, uh, the lead. I think we had Dave playing the floor at that time. So, um, so you know, kind of put away early. Other than that, you know, Kev, you uh, know, uh, we just had to make an adjustment. You obviously had it going. You found something there. To, again, when you get in that zone, can you kind of feel like you're, I don't want to say, you're assuming no one can stop you, but do you have the confidence you're going to score against anybody? Uh, yeah, I'm just trying to, you know, in those times we score. Uh, I mean, I had a uh, little run going myself, and uh, just trying to take advantage of it. They went on a huge run at the end of the second quarter, carried over into the start of the third. What happened there? Uh, I think it was the same thing that happened in the, in the third. You know, we went to a, a smaller lineup, had Dave at the four. And, they had Green still out there, which was uh, kind of stretching us out because uh, they went to a bigger lineup. So um, that's where, where it happened. Yeah. yeah. Jordan, I mean, have you embraced your six man role, and especially playing against Lou Williams today? I mean, just what was it like? I mean, just the season you're having this year? I mean, I've, I've been doing this for a while now since uh, you know I've been in LA, getting traded here. Uh, it's my role now, and uh, this is what I came to do. Of course, everyone in the Philippines is waiting for you. Have you figured out if you're going to join the national team this year? Uh, I don't know yet. Uh, stay tuned. I hope to, and uh, I hope it happens. Do you have any message for your uh, for the team, Philippines, and the fans back there? Um, let's just be ready. Um, you know, we're going to go in there, try to win, and uh, do a good job. I know a few of my teammates going to be playing in the World Cup as well, so uh, hopefully we get some wins over them and um, do what we got to do. Williams on the other side, but Jordan Clarkson had a pretty impressive game tonight. What did you see in him? Jordan played pretty well, but he, um, you know, he came up the bench and gave us a gave us a spurt, uh, you know, particularly in that uh, second half when we were down, we were down the game. He, um, you know, made some really nice drives for the basket. Um, yeah, made some very great time with baskets. Um, but you know, you know, we dig a hole like that. It's tough to overcome. Got to exert a lot of energy. Um, and we just weren't able to overcome. How about Jordan Collin as well? I know Collin is continuing to grow and understand what he needs to be for this team. Are you seeing that growth? Yeah, growth. Growth is is is, is a key thing with, with with both guys. I think they're they're moving in the right direction. Um, both I thought made some. Made some, uh, you know, made some nice plays, um, um, but again, as this thing, uh, as this thing winds down, they just have to continue and, and, and continue to do things that they've been doing thus far. And then some of the areas where they can be better at, just continue to grow in those areas. Uh, both guys, I really believe, uh, you know, because Portland are hard workers. I really believe they'll get better. Kevin, shoulder. Yeah, yeah, he uh, he actually complained about his shoulder a little bit uh, last night. Um, and it was a little sore, so we did not uh, have a chance. Uh, I'm sorry again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, we you talk about us, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah. We talk a lot about particularly being on the road as far as uh, taking care of basketball. Um, you know, that allows us to, to, to play the way we want to play. It allows us to kind of dictate the rhythm of the game um, if, if we take care of the basketball. And, and, we turned it up, uh, you know. We didn't turn it over much, but the, uh, you know, that was the good, the, the good part about it, the bad part about it is every time we did, they scored on, you know. So you have to, uh, you know, you you have to take care of the ball, particularly when you're on the road, particularly against a good team, particularly against a team that really wants to get out and, and, and run. You have to take away those easy baskets, but unfortunately tonight we didn't do a good job with that. That's a direct correlation of not having Kevin Love in the lineup, somebody that's a playmaker for you. It takes him some time to adjust. Well, it's always good to have um, your, 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 your key guy, your, your, your go-to guy, because you can run your offense uh, uh, through him. Uh, with no Kevin Love in the lineup, um, you know, we have to we have to do a little bit different, you know, but obviously with him there, we, uh, we rely on him a lot to, uh, to, to, to initiate our post up, everything we do. Um, what we do go through Kevin, he, he's the initiator, but, um, you know, we, we played without him uh, 50 plus games this year. And uh, I think our guys have, um, I won't say they've gotten used to it, but uh, they know when he's, he's not there. You know, they know the things that we do have to do. 
uh, particularly again being on the road as far as taking care of basketball um, and, and, and making sure we have good shot selection. You called, you did call timeouts for taps. You weren't happy. Well, my first time out, um, you know, they basically had scored on every possession. Um, and that's just not a way, that's not a way to start the game, you know, particularly on the road. Um, you know, we, we, you know, our matchups, uh, which I, you know, kind of felt that uh, it w would be a little bit, a uh, little bit tough for us uh, because we were matching, matched up a little bit differently than we did the first time. Uh, and we were not getting back and we were not matching. Up. And that's, that's why I had to call the early time out to, to find out, you know, what the hell was going on. Was this a case where David just wasn't big enough to handle what they had in their front court? Um, you know, matchups, matchups, um, you know, they did, they did hurt us. Um, it, it was, it was not David, it was more Jetty. It was more Jetty, uh, because we actually, uh, uh started Dave on the, uh, Dave was out on the front court playing the point guard. Uh, Jetty was starting off on, on the, uh, on the game. And, and, and that gave us a, uh, that gave us some early problems. Um, I called the timeout, uh, really early in the third quarter. Uh, just to just to to go bigger uh, and put Larry in the game and took David out, um, and it actually had some uh, you know it has had a merit to it. We, we were able to get get, uh, get into a little bit of a rhythm, but uh, uh, they were crashing crashing the glass uh, so hard, and they were actually just uh, you know really establishing themselves in the paint. And I just thought we had to go bigger, so we did go bigger.